What's going on, YouTube? It's the Bushy Beard, and I'm back. Uh, been bushier than ever. Uh, so I did this whole video, and I recorded it, or so I thought, but I didn't record it. Uh, I listed off all the new subscribers, which there was a lot of them. Uh, and so here I would like to say thank you to all the subscribers. I don't have the names anymore because I checked them all off. Uh, I appreciate each and every one of you. I really do. I think being at 730 subscribers blows my mind and I can't believe I'm here. Uh, and we're still climbing, which again blows my mind. I never thought I would be uh, this popular. I didn't think I had that good of uh, opinions. But um, <sighs> I'm debating whether or not I, 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 so I think I'll just give you my overview of it, right? Uh, I listened to it. Um, there are parts of it that I really like. Like, here we go. So like th those parts, the very stripped down parts without the heavy beat. And I think that those parts would have gotten an A minus. If it had been that whole song, if the whole song had been that way, it would have gotten an A minus. However, because of parts like parts like this, like the heavy beat part, I didn't like. I don't like the heavy beat to it. I feel like it's very uh, overdone for this song, and I didn't particularly care for it. Um, and then also. Uh, I know she does that effect a lot. Um, I feel like it doesn't belong on this song, though. I feel I feel like it makes it comical, and it doesn't need to be comical. This is this was a good song lyric wise, without adding all that stuff in. I think it, if they had left it stripped down, and again, I'm not questioning her artistic um, choices because she's not making music for me, and so I might be out of the circle on this one, right? Uh, there might be a group of people that really love the way this sounds and I just might be way out in left field But it was not a particularly great video for me um, And I'm gonna leave the link in the uh, Description so that you guys can check it out on your own time um, I just I felt like if I go through it again like acting like I hadn't heard it uh, or I don't know It, it would have felt fake to me and I don't want to come off as fake and things like that so that's why I'm letting you know I had just did the whole video and that this is what happened but uh overall I gave it a B minus I think a minus for the lyrics and the stripped down parts but because of the heavy beat part like I, I felt like it couldn't make up his mind do it does it want to be a bass heavy song that uh, is good for dance clubs or does it want to be a stripped down love song um, and I felt like there was just a disconnect for me. And um, so, yeah, that's why I gave it a B minus. I think it's just, it was too wishy-washy for me. And I, there were some things that I picked up on, like I'm your American queen and things like that, that I think were really well done because it's obviously about Joe and Joe is from Britain. The British people have king and queens. She is the American queen. Um, and he is her king, and the whole monarchy thing. I think it was a well, well done play on the the monarch, mon, monarchical, monarchical, uh, the system of government by the British. I know it's monarchy. I, monarchical, I think is the word. Um, but yeah, so um, that's why I'm not <laughs> playing the music today. Uh, again, I will put it down in the description so you can go and listen to it. If you would like, but um, yeah, I didn't want to be fake. So that's really the whole thing. Um, we'll be back tomorrow with another one and we'll go from there. Uh, until next time, YouTube, smile like you mean it from the Bushy Bee.